In this presentation, we're going to look at the R command P norm, which is used for the cumulative distribution function in R. It is for used for the normal distribution specifically. Now, what we're going to do is first off consider the two key parameters that define the normal distribution. They are the mean, mu, which is that Greek symbol there, but in R it specifies simply as mean. There's also the standard deviation sigma, which in R is specified as SD, standard deviation. So suppose the mean and standard deviation for the heights of Irish students are as follows. Suppose the mean is 172 centimeters and suppose the standard deviation is 10 centimeters. So here is what we're asked. Compute the probability of an Irish student being no taller than 180 centimeters. That is to say, less than or equal to 180 centimeters. This is actually known as the cumulative distribution function here. X means the height. And be mindful of the fact of the direction of the operator there. It means less than or equal to. Okay, we would call that the cumulative distribution function. Now, what we're going to do is use R to compute that. So I'm going to bring up R now. That's the next question there. So I'm going to bring up R first off. So we're going to compute that first off, 180 centimeters. Now the command is P norm. Then we write in the value that we are interested in finding the probability for. Then we write in the mean of the population and the standard deviation, which was 172 and 10 centimeters. So the answer is 78.81% or 0.7881. We'll disregard the rest of those decimal places. So that is the answer that we're interested in first off, 78.81%. Bring that down now. So go back here a second. And the answer, write down the answer, confirm the answer. 78.81%. Now, next question. Compute the probability of an Irish student being taller than 185 centimeters. So that is the complement of being less than or equal to 185 centimeters. Actually, the equality component of the operator is not really that important. Uh, so, what we are going to do is first off find the complement of 185 centimeters, the cumulative distribution for that, and we're also going to look at how to use the lower equals false argument, which is also how we might, we, we might implement the uh, complement of a cumulative distribution function. So let's go back to R. Well, the first approach we're going to take is 1 minus P norm. 185, mean is 172, and standard deviation equals 10. So the answer is about 9.68%. Okay, but we're also going to do the, use the lower equals false approach. So that is 185, mean of 172, and standard deviation equals 10. And oop, lower equals false. So that gives us the that gives us the cumulative distribution function, and that gives us the complement of the cumulative distribution function. These two numbers add up to one because they are complements of each other. And you notice that what I have highlighted here is the exact same number as this. So that concludes our presentation.